how to backup your data to the external USB drive on the Samsung Galaxy S24 series. Now before you start to backup the data, you will need to have an external adapter so that you can connect your USB drive to the to the phone. So here is the USB-C to USB-A adapter. Get yourself one of these. They are very cheap. And also you need a USB drive and make sure the USB drive uh, storage is large enough to hold all your backup data. So the bigger the better because your phone uh, have a very high storage capacity. So we're going to plug the USB drive into the adapter and then plug the adapter into the Galaxy device. And then tap on the home button to go back to the home screen. Now you may want to check to see if there is any data on your USB drive that you want to save before uh, backing up the device data to the USB drive. So if you have any data, you can back it up to a computer first uh, and then we need to format the drive. So to do that, first we're going to swipe down at the top, then tap on the settings icon. Next, scroll down and then tap on account and backup. In here, tap on external storage transfer. Then in here, select USB storage. On the select data to backup page, you can see by default it is set to everything, everything. and this is 22.47 gigabytes of data on my device. It gives you an estimated time of 15 minutes to complete the backup. Now I'm going to go down and select custom and then tap on next. With the custom uh, option, you'll be able to see what you backup. So in here, if you like, you can select the all option, which will allow you to uh, back up everything. Now I'm not going to back up everything. This is only a demonstration video. So here I can choose to back up calls and contacts or messages. Uh, I can skip apps because apps will take up 18.13 uh, gigabytes of data. Now for each of the category, you can tap on the right arrow to view more information. So for example, messages, I can tap on the right arrow. In here, I can choose how to backup my messages data. Now I can backup all the messages, all the messages in the last two years, one year, six months, last three months, or the last 30 days. So select one of the options. And then if we go down, so actually I'm going to select in the last 30 days only. And then down here we got uh, images that you can also back up as well as home screen. If I tap on images and tap on the right arrow, in here I can choose to back up everything by the albums or by selecting individual images that I want to uh, back up. So in here I'll go back into camera and I can go down and select just the items that I want to back up or I can simply select just try to do multi select here multiple select here uh, it doesn't seem like it allow me to do multiple select so i have to go down and select uh, one image at a time or i can choose the whole album or select all so here i'm going to say select just a few images just so that my backup will be quick uh, in this demo video and then you can also choose your backup videos as well videos has larger uh, file size so tap on done so I will deselect all and just select one file and then tap on done and then down here you can back up your audio file such as your mp3 music and other audio file tap on done and then here we got documents and files that you can also back up such as PDF files so swap across here and choose the folder that you want to back up then tap on done Next, once you have selected all the files that you would like to backup, now tap on the backup button. And there's a here, data backup and encrypted using your Samsung account. So tap on OK. And here is a four minutes left. And because I have only selected limited number of files, you can see the backup is fairly quick. So we wait for that to finish. 
Okay, once it has finished, it will give you a summary of your backup results. Uh, it will tell you what has been backup. Tapping on the show more button will allow you to view a full list of the backup files. After that, tap on next, then tap on done. And that's it. So let's um, let's examine what is stored on our USB drive. So I'm going to open up the file manager from the Samsung folder. So tap on my files. My files is a file manager on your device. In here, I'm going to tap on USB storage one. And then you can see here it said smart switch backup two. So if you open that up, you will be able to view your backup file. So we've got call lock, um, call lock settings, contact, um, download settings, documents, uh, etc, etc folder, gallery, uh, event, gallery settings, gallery widget, home screen. So if I try to open this up, they are in a zip file. And here you can see uh, when I tap on it, it will allow me to select that to extract the files. Now these files are encrypted, so I suspect that you will not be able to view the files directly. Uh, you may need to uh, open it or decrypt it before you can actually uh, view the file. So in here it actually allows me to view the files when I tap on it. Uh, maybe because on this phone here, uh, using the, the encryption on the phone so I can uh, open the files. But I suspect that if you try to open it uh, from another device, you may not be able to view uh, the files, the encrypted files. And that's it. So uh, files has now been backed up to your USB drive. Uh, later on, when you want to restore those files, you can do so from the same uh, screen. So we go into accounts and backup and go to external storage transfer in here. Uh, you can see it said restore from and it show you the file that has been backup. So in here you can select the files that you would like to restore from. And here it says select data to restore. And that's it. Thank you for watching this video. Please like and subscribe to my channel for my videos.